In this program, we're going to learn about day and night. What causes day and night? We have day and night because the Earth rotates or spins on its axis. Earth's axis is an imaginary line passing through the north and south poles. The Earth takes a whole day, or 24 hours, to make one complete turn. At any time during its rotation, half of the Earth faces the Sun. This part experiences day. The other half of Earth faces away from the Sun and receives no light. This part experiences night. The sun appears to move across the sky, rising in the east in the morning and setting in the west as the day ends. The sun itself is not actually moving. It is the earth rotating, which makes it seem as though the sun is moving across the sky. Different parts of Earth experience different lengths of daylight throughout the year. The length of daylight changes depending on where you live on Earth and where the tilted Earth is in its orbit. The equator, or the imaginary line that circles the Earth around its middle, experiences nearly 12 hours of daylight and 12 hours of darkness year-round, and even split. Moving away from the equator in either direction, the amount of daylight becomes uneven until you get to the poles, where they can experience either 24 hours of full daylight or 24 hours of full darkness. These areas north of the Arctic Circle experience between two months of midnight sun or 24 hours of constant sunlight during the summer and 24 hours of darkness known as polar night when the sun never rises. The extreme northern and southern points on Earth experience these uneven amounts of sunlight not only because of their geographical location, but because of the tilt of the Earth on its axis. This tilt, in combination with the Earth's position in orbit around the Sun, causes the amount of daylight to change throughout the year for most of the globe, not just its extremes. Now that you better understand day and night, and what causes changes in the amount of daylight we experience, think about this. What kinds of plants and animals can live somewhere that has two months of darkness? <laughs>